Good morning, good morning, good morning. It has been a while since I started a vlog like this. Um, I just got in the car, finally got my license renewed. It's been expired for almost a whole year. Finally got it renewed so I can finally go get my own coffee. So I'm headed to Duncan right now. Well, I'm not moving yet, but I'll be moving in a second. Go get my Duncan. I wanna go fabric shopping today. I have not been fabric shopping in almost a whole year. Um, so I wanna go to Joanne's or Hobby Lobby, I don't know which one. Um, they're both pretty close to each other, so we'll see. Probably Joanne's. And then, well, before I do that, I have to package all the AJ Blanks orders, KCD orders, all that stuff. Um, so I'm gonna try to get my coffee. Otherwise, if I have to wait for Keenan, he usually gets it around like nine ish, and it's seven o'clock right now. So I'd rather just go myself and get it and then start my day earlier. I was able to sneak out of the bed without Roman waking up. So that is a win in my book. So I'm gonna go ahead and go. Oh, my butt's getting warm. I have the seat warmer. So I'm gonna go ahead and go and get my coffee and get my day started. to go home and well first I gotta find my keys let's go okay so I made it back home um I'm gonna go ahead and pull some AJ Blanks orders until my um parent and my parent in laws my um, my in laws come <coughs> um um, so this computer is super slow, so I'm gonna wait for it to turn on and pull some orders. There's really not that many orders because we're out of stock of our most important sizes. <laughs> we're not getting that many orders, but for those of you who are ordering, I really, really appreciate it. Um, I'm hoping the 2T, 3T, and 4T girls white come in in the next few days. Um, so like Monday, Tuesday-ish. I don't know exact date for sure. I just have to wait. For them to be delivered um so i got those to come in early and then i also have uh the complete restock of like the bodysuits gowns everything else will be in hopefully by the end of the month um so like i said i just got the 2t 3t 4t girls white shipped sooner um and when we move to a new house i'm hoping to not be out of stock again i mean if i get it out of stock at that point then it's fine but I'm hoping to try to stay in stock. It has just been difficult to gauge, you know, which way the orders are going to go. Because at first I was completely over-ordering. So then I, my accountant was like, hey, you need to tone back. So I toned back and guess what happened? I sold out. So it's a good thing, but, you know, I don't want to be sold out for this long. Rather, if I'm sold out, it should only be for maximum a week. Not, it's been almost like a month. And that's a bit long, longer than I would like to be sold out. And I'm sure you guys probably agree with that. So go ahead and pull some blank orders um so my husband can ship them and i did all my etsy orders that are scheduled to ship today they're already done but um i may just work on a few more while he's packaging these just to get stuff done i mean doesn't hurt to get things done early and then if i get those done then i can just work on new items which is why i'm going to etsy not to etsy to joanne's to see if i can find anything new that i would like so i'm gonna go ahead and check emails um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and pull these orders.
Okay, so all the AJ Blanks orders are pulled. I'm gonna go upstairs waiting for Kenan to get ready so we can just go to the post office, UPS, and go to Joanne's. It's so nice because it's like, what time is it? It's 10 o'clock, so I literally have like no time limit for Joanne's. Usually like if I go, which it hasn't been a while, but like I have like an hour-ish, like there's no time limit. I don't think Keenan realizes that yet, but it's cool. So I'm excited to finally go out like normal. Used to go out to Joanne's all the time because it was like 10 minutes, not even from my, not my last house, the house before that. Um, and I have not gone once since I've been in this house, which is insane because we're a lot closer. I think it's like 25 minutes from me. So we're gonna go head out to Joanne's. So we'll see you guys there. <laughs> We have arrived. There is Keenan and Joanne's over here. So let's go shopping. Fabric. Okay, guys, so this is. Can you record over here, sir? Over here. The solid knit section. So this is the fabric I always tell you guys to get. The knit fabric. Um, here's the skew code. Can you focus on that? Skew. I will. Touch the screen skew. if it's not focusing. Focus. It is? Okay, so this is the fabric. It's 40% off right now. It says till the 21st, April 21st, it'll be 40% off. So use this to make your samples. Don't waste shirts. I need some for myself. Let's keep shopping. With embroidery for the applicator, you can use pretty much any fabric you want to an extent, as long as you put heat and bond on the back. So the knit fabrics work as well. Um, I really like this dinosaur one, so I'm gonna take some of this dinosaur fabric and it's 30% off. And I wish these little bears were smaller because I would definitely use this. Um, but it's too big. And... Let's see what else is here. Oh, this is cute. They have cute stuff, but again, I like stuff that will fit inside of a number for my number of But I do like this rainbow one, so I'm gonna get some of this as well. And I do use these as well. These are like the like legging spandexy materials. I've used this as well, and I put this. I use heat and bond on it, so it helps it uh, adhere to the shirt more. They have this. Some of you guys can use this to make a tutu. Just an idea. It is in the So Sweet collection. Guys, look, this Joann's has a name thingy. It's not the numbers anymore. That's awesome. Does your guys at Joann's have those? Comment down below. Okay, guys, we have made it home. It's one o'clock. We stopped for a lunch date. And it was in company. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you the fabrics I did end up getting. Um... They got said about recording in there, so I stopped recording. But 
I got this knit fabric. You know, rainbows are popular, super cute fabric. And I got half yards of everything. Um, I used to either do a quarter or a half, depending on what I plan on doing with it. For number appliques, a half yard is pretty good because you can get quite a few out. Here's another knit fabric. This is dinosaurs with rainbows. I didn't even notice that it was rainbows. Well, I didn't notice at all. And this is one I already have. This shirt I've had in my Etsy shop for about three years. And in the last two weeks, I've sold three of these shirts. And I'm like, oh my God, I'm out of fabric. I didn't think I'd ever be able to find the fabric again, so I took the listing down, but I can put it back up now. So I got um, half a yard of this. This one I think is super cute for watermelons. So I'll find out something to do with this, something. That was half a yard. Again, everything's half a yard. And then this baseball fabric. So I think that'll be cute. I'm like gonna do the name in like navy and um, red colors this is also a fabric i already have i was sold out of it it was selling and like i said i haven't been to joanne's in so long so i got some more of this this fabric is like feathers focus feathers so i'm gonna do um like a dream catcher one with this fabric this one was this fabric was cuter when I first saw it, I don't really like it anymore. But it's a bunch of fruit. Um, I think if the background was completely white, it'd be different. But it's like a beige color, so I don't know how it's going to look on the white shirt. So, not 100% sure about this one. This fabric, I used to have a similar one. Um, but I sold out of it a long time ago. And... Um, it sold very well with this unicorn design I had, so I'm going to make a new version of it with this fabric and put it up. This fabric I really, really like, so I have two options that I'm going to use this for. Don't y'all copy me yet. Wait till I make my stuff first, okay? Okay, it's my ideas. <laughs> no, I'm just joking, but this fabric I want to do like a race car, like monster truck. And then I want to do it for a pirate ship uh, shirt as well. So both ideas for this fabric. <laughs> this one, I'll be honest, I just got it because it was cute. Um, giraffe, young wild, some sort of wildish theme. Not 100% sure, but I liked it. So I purchased it. And all these fabrics were 40% off. And then so each piece was $3. So super cheap. This fabric, I just really liked it, <laughs> so I bought it. I almost got a yard of it, but again, I didn't have a reason to because I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. It's just cute. This fabric, the little piggies. Um, I'm just going to make a pig shirt. These are just going to be like a number applique. So most of these will be like number applique shirts. Um, but trying to find quick, simple designs to make that, you know, I can make a lot of. This one is super cute. It's like buttons. So um, I'm going to make a sewing buttons birthday shirt with this one. This fabric, this is like the OG, OG fabric. Um, I have a shirt, probably one, one of the first non-character fabric shirts I made was this one. Um, and oh, I'm out. <laughs> So I'm like, well, I can put this one back up now too. So, hey, I got half a yard of that. This one I really like. I'm going to do like obviously like a lion jungle theme with this one. This fabric, fire and police trucks. So super cute, super simple. And the last one, I have so many monster fabrics and I always say I'm going to use them, but I never have. But, um... I think this is super cute, so I'm gonna use this one for a monster shirt. And then, of course, I got three yards of the knit fabric. This is what I use to make samples. I don't use t-shirts unless I'm making it for my kids. Um, so I use this, use this instead. It is 40% off, so I bought three yards of it. So this will make me quite a bit of shirts. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it for what I got today from Joann's. Thank you guys for tuning in and sticking around. 
If you can give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, I'd really appreciate it. And now I'm going to be off to making some new designs. Well, Keenan needs a haircut first. He wants another haircut. So I've got to go turn myself to the barber mode and become the barber. And then I'll come down and make some shirts because, like, it's 1 o'clock. 1.01. And, like, that's four hours of time I have to create after I do his haircut, though. Like I said, making stuff is more fun, like, when you don't, it's not for an order, but it's, like, you're just being creative. So I like doing that. So I do have a few orders that need to ship tomorrow. It's three. Three of them have to ship tomorrow. So we'll see what I do, but. That'll be for another video. So I really appreciate you guys sticking around watching this video. Um, AJ Bucks five dollar giveaway winner. I gotta pick somebody. Let me go on my YouTube. Look at my last YouTube video. So the winner of today's five dollar AJ Bucks is going to be the PJ Mame. Thank you. You comment on pretty much every single one of my videos. So I really appreciate all the support. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Please and please. Please email info.ajblanks at gmail.com to claim your $5 AJ books. Okay, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!